this craft that I just created became, easily became one of my mother's what the heck is that crafts. So in a few moments, I'll show you how you can make a craft similar to this. It's so simple and easy. All I did was suspend two wine bottles to each other so that one is in the air and one is down. This, in this position, the top bottle is the bigger bottle. You can have them both the same size, but I kind of like the look of having a big bottle and a small bottle together. So if you stay tuned, I'll show you how quick and easy it is to create. And hopefully you may come up with an idea that you have and leave a comment below to tell me about it. So let me show you how simple it is. This is the position with the smaller bottle at the bottom. I didn't continue the slats all the way down so that it has a little bit of contrast. I can easily flip it over and put the slats at all the way to the bottom. So if you put it on a table or an edge, it will go all the way to the bottom. And this is the bigger bottle. And how I did it was I made it so that the slats are wider apart in the front and closer together in the back. You could easily attach this to something like a board or something that has lights so that you make it into a light display. Just to give you an idea of how it would look next to lights, you can paint it with gold, silver, or any color. You can get different colored wine bottles so that you have maybe a white bottle, a red bottle for the holidays, or just any different colors. And it would be so pretty with a pretty blue, similar to the blue in this jar. So you have so many options. So let me show you how fast it is to make. You just take a wine bottle, and I like different sizes. You'll put a cork inside. In this case, I cut this cork down to make it easier. But in a, if you do this, I would recommend using some sort of permanent adhesive or hot glue. In this case, I didn't need to because the cork fit both bottles and it suspended it, so it was easier just to put together. So I just want to show you how what you'll do is you'll twist it until the cork connects and you'll press it all the way down until they connect. You could also put something else in between. So if you decide to make it into a light fixture, you could leave a gap in between or put something else between. And I'm just gonna show you how, if you start to apply tension, it's very secure. So let me just show you that, how secure that is. So this is holding up this bottle. I think this would be really cool if you put a few together, maybe to give you an idea. Put it together like that on a piece of wood that would be really nice and just kind of suspend it together and have multiples, sort of making a star shape out of it. So that might be a cool way of doing this. So just to recreate it quickly, you're going to take the slats from a pair of blinds. And when you have these plastic type of slats, they're so easy to cut. I'll show you in a moment. So you'll take the slat and quickly cut it with a pair of scissors and it cuts pretty even. And that's it. All you have to do is then attach it. 